Hey adventurers, today we're at Disney's Wilderness Lodge and we are getting ready to go in for dinner at Artist Point, which is a signature dining experience. Come along with us. This is the front area of the dining room. Beautiful lighting. Beautiful high ceilings. The architecture in here is amazing. There's another view of the beautiful painting. Beautiful. Here's our table over here. There's our view. We have a balcony out here, but currently the doors are locked. Here are the appetizers. I'm going to be trying the free short rib, and Lisa's going to be trying the artisanal cheeses. The um, smoked mushroom bisque is also very good. And here are the entrees. We're going to go with the 32 ounce aged bone and ribeye for two tonight. We've never tried that before, so we're certainly looking forward to that. Normally, um, we either order the um, buffalo or the um, Chinook salmon. So, doing it a little different tonight. Always good to mix it up. We have quite a nice um, variety here. We're doing the dining plan so it doesn't qualify for the taste of the Pacific. But this is also a good option, something that we've never tried. But if we do come here, without the dining plan, that's a definite possibility. Quite an extensive um, wine list and drink menu, and actually I was just informed that something that may not be on the menu may be also available at the lounge right down the hall. So don't be afraid to ask. If you don't see it on the menu, certainly ask your server, and I'm sure they would be glad to accommodate you. And if not, you could always just go to, I believe it's called the Territory Lounge. Drinks are served. I got a pina colada, and what did you get? It's called Uncle Val's. It's a gin, and I sure it said elderberry. You have some edible flowers in there as well. And an edible flower. Very light, and I believe a lime. Maybe. Would you care to eat one? Yeah. Mm. You can eat this. Mm -hmm. It's edible. Yeah. Tastes like what a flower fish tastes. Very floral. Floral. <laughs> appetizer. This is a short rib Belenese over a proper del pa pasta. And here is the cheese plate. Doesn't that look amazing? Here's the information about that. Awesome. That looks quite good. What do you think? Oh. Beautiful. Here's our sides. These are called kiwi potatoes. And these are the Brussels sprouts with a vinaigrette. They look like amazing. And over here is the multi green sourdough bread, which was really good. And here's the butter. We mashed it up a little bit already, but. It has a sea salt topping on it. Very good. Look at that blade. That's a nice one. It's a little fatty here. Okay. Let's get to the meat of the potato. This is bone. Bone is coming all the way here. Is it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah thank you. 
so you can see. This is all the all the way to here. That's garlic. Yes. Let's see what this looks like in the middle here. How thick are we here? Like two inches. This is uh, medium. It's a little bit more towards medium well, but it's very good. The, the meat's very good. It's tender, so mm -hmm. not an issue. Non issue. That is a non issue. All right, mm -hmm. without further ado, we are tearing into this. That's it. Enough of this. Wait a minute. Just like you know, you got the boom. <laughs> Get in there. Get in Best there. Steak ever. Get in there. Is a ribeye. Mmm. <laughs> it's my cave woman side. Mmm. That's the best part. Show that thing who's at the top of the food chain. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, I've waved, I've waved the white flag over here with the steak. So this much left. Lisa's still going in on it. How's it going over there? Filling up. I'm saving a little bit of room for dessert, so I could probably eat some more. But I know how good the desserts are here, so mm -hmm. I'm choosing not to. And there's still some sides left over there, but you know what? When you try to weigh it out, desserts are sides. And dessert, for real. But that is a very good steak. Highly recommended. Mm -hmm. Very good. We have come to the best part of the meal. The dessert menu. So I got the almond butter cookies with the salted toffee milkshake. And these just ordered the vanilla bean creme brulee. Delish. Can't wait to see it. Here are the desserts. Salted toffee milkshake and almond cookies. They look so good, don't they? Yummy. And a cute little milk crate. Look at that. And what do we have here? This is the vanilla bean creme brulee. 